Grace's room. I am so relieved because I have finally finished my end of year exams. It was a pretty stressful period, but I'm so glad that it's done now. And I've got to be honest, during that time, I wasn't really looking after my skin as well as I usually do. And I ended up having a couple of little breakouts and stuff on my face. So now that that stress is gone, I thought that today I would take the opportunity to have a bit of a self-care pamper day where I would, um, you know, wash my hair, have a bath and like do a bit of skincare as well because my skin definitely needs it. So I thought I would show you guys my routine, what I usually do to pamper myself. So first thing I'm gonna do is wash my hair. So for hair care, usually I just shampoo and conditioner my hair like normal, but my hairdresser actually gave me this new hair mask to try. It's from Kerastase, I think that's how you say it. Um, and it's supposed to be really good for like oily hair, which I definitely have, and it's supposed to just like really clean your scalp and get rid of like any dirt and stuff. So I thought that I would try it. It also smells like so nice as well, it's really pretty too. But firstly, I'm just going to rinse my hair and then I'll use it. Alright, so now I'm just going to be using a little bit of conditioner. Um, my hairdresser just gave me a little sample to try out. Uh, it comes in the, I don't remember what it's called, it just comes in the same range as this uh, hair mask. But I'm just going to use a little bit on the ends of my hair and I'm going to leave it in for like 10 to 15 minutes. So I thought that I would just clip up my hair because I want to have a bath while I let that sit for like 15 minutes. So I thought that I would have a bubble bath. I got this like little bubble bath mixture from uh, Sephora. It's like this lagoon scent. It smells really nice. Very like ocean -y, just like my favorite kind of scents. So I thought that I would find that. bath is all set up. That um, bubble bath smells so good by the way. Definitely re recommend that. Um, but I think I'm just going to chill for a little bit and then I'll do like my body wash and exfoliator. Now I'm going to be washing my body. So I'm going to be using um, from all kinds the whipped shower foam from the Sweet Talk collection and then also got this bath sponge the other day from all kinds as well from their new limited edition range. I thought it looks so cute, it looks so far. So I'll just rinse that a little bit and then I guess I'll just wash my body. So now it's time to exfoliate. I'm going to be using this uh, Rose Hip Body Scrub and Cleanser from Frank Body, which just smells so good. I love rose scents, so like this is just so nice. So I'm just going to use that on my arms like and legs. Now. All right, I feel very fresh right now. I thought I'd put on my satin pajamas because I feel very glamorous right now. <laughs> anyway, um, it's time to do some skincare, and I'm gonna start off by taking off my makeup. So I've just got this like little um, reusable makeup remover. You just wet under some water, and it takes it off. All right, now it's time for some cleanser. I'm pretty sure I've used this in a lot of my um, other routines I've done, but I'm using this Eco by Sonia Super Citrus Cleanser, which I love using. It's just, it's very smooth on the face. Alright, so um, 
now that my face is all cleansed, it's time to go in with an exfoliator. Um, I don't think I'm going to be using an exfoliator because I'm going to be trying out this new face mask. It's from this brand called Youth to the People. Um, it's a super clay, purify and clear power mask. So it's just supposed to be really good for like um, cleaning out like, your pores and your face. And it's probably good for like, you know, teen skin if you're having a lot of breakouts. And I think you're supposed to use this clay mask instead of just using exfoliator. I think using exfoliator might be a little bit overkill. So I'm just <laughs> going to try this out. Anyway, um, the lady recommended it at Sephora. So I thought that I would try it. face mask sit for like about three to five minutes and I thought that while I let that sit I would put on my body moisturizer sorry this is a body butter technically it's from Fenty skin I really like this one it smells it smells really good too mask has dried up on my skin now so it's time to take it off I thought that I would do my lip mask now so I don't strip off any like other skincare products I put on my skin I'm just using this cherry one from Frank Body so I say Frank Green <laughs> Frank Body um, this one smells so good and my lips are really dry at the moment, so I definitely need these. My lips feel so much better. I love doing lip scrubs. I do them usually like once a week, but they're so good. Okay, now I'm going to be using some glycolic acid as a toner. This is from The Ordinary. Um, I've used this a couple of times. I'm just sort of trying it out at the moment because I read that it's supposed to be really good for your skin. Um, if you're thinking about using it, make sure you do research first like, to make sure it's you know, suitable for your skin type. But I just like to put this around like little breakout areas and stuff. So now it's time to moisturize. I'm using this super fruit hydrator from Eco by Sonia Driver. And I really like this moisturizer as well. It's very smooth. Now I'm gonna be using some of this Glory Oil from um, the Eco by Sonia brand. And I think you're supposed to just use a little bit of this like on like areas maybe we have a bit of like scarring and stuff like that to help heal. I have quite a bit of that on my chin. So another new product I'm trying from The Ordinary is this Lash and Brow Serum. I'm going to use it on my lash line because I want my lashes to grow. I was not sadly blessed with long eyelashes. James was. I was not. Don't know why. So hopefully this will help. Finally, like my favorite lip product ever, it's this um, Langine Lip Sleeping Mask. It's very popular, it's already, you've probably already heard of it, but I love using it. It's just, honestly, I use it like it's a normal like, lip balm every day. It just makes your lips so it looks so glossy and feel very smooth. All right, let's wash that off. Okay, so that's all for my skincare. There's a couple of steps. Honestly, I could do that every night, but, um, I just like, you know, I thought since it's my pamper night, I would go a little bit above and beyond. <laughs> so now um, it's time to do my hair. Before I dry it though, I'm going to put just this product in. It's this Kerastase, um, I don't know how to say that, <laughs> but it's just like a little like hair cream. Um, makes your hair smell nice. I know it's got good properties, but I like it mainly because it makes <laughs> your hair smell really nice. over how good this smells amazing I don't want I don't like to use it too often because like I don't want to waste it but it just smells so good <laughs> all right now it's time to dry my hair so I think I'm just gonna do a little general drying of my hair and then I think I want to use the air wrap today
hair is all done now. It feels very smooth. I'm happy with how it turned out. Hopefully that's because of the conditioner and the hair mask. But uh, that's pretty much all for my little pamper routine. I had a lot of fun doing it. I always love to be having a little self-care night and everything. I feel very clean right now. I love feeling clean. I just feel very clean, you know. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Don't forget to check out my Instagram at Grace's World Official. I'm going to go to sleep now, but I'll see you guys next time on Grace's Room. Bye for now.